The 404 page is actually pretty simple. According to WordPress, this file must be named 404.php. WordPress doesn't have any recommendations for this page, so we're going to keep it really simple. Create a file named 404.php and let's copy the code from page.php into this file. We're going to get rid of the loop completely. I'm also going to get rid of the sidebar and change this number from 8 to 12. This will make our page full width. This class is specific to Bootstrap and not WordPress. Inside our Sections tag, I'm going to use a font awesome frown icon. Then I'm going to output 404 exclamation mark page not found exclamation mark. This message will be inside h1 tags and have a class of text center text danger. Let's make this string translatable. Go to your site and try visiting a completely random URL. You should see something similar to what I see. I've said it a hundred times and I'll say it again. WordPress takes care of handling which templates to display. All we have to do is follow the naming conventions and create the templates. WordPress will make all queries and run any functions necessary to display a page.